Let's hope for twins. <laughs> Our fingers are crossed. Well, we never know, but you know, <laughs> one or more. <laughs>、Hey、guys, I thought we would sit down and catch you guys up a little bit on our crazy infertility week.、Uh, as you guys know, we had a really rough finish to last week. It was just a big downer for us. The first time we've ever gone through a chemical pregnancy、uh, so, that we knew、so、of. You know, it was、yeah. so difficult. We took the weekend. We needed the weekend. Yeah. And then we had no choice but to bounce back and get it started again on Monday. Yeah, because we had already received a text from our nurse. Saying that because I had started my cycle officially, she wanted us to、uh, go ahead and get an ultrasound and blood work right away, and we were able to do that on cycle day four, which was last Monday. Right. So you guys saw that vlog. <laughs> It's actually it was uploaded today. Today. <laughs> yeah, as we record this. So apologies for the delay、uh, from that vlog, but you know it was. We had a good, good reason. Yeah, <laughs> we had no idea that the day was going to turn out the way that it did.、Yeah. You know, we got home and we thought we were going to just wind things down here and close out the vlog. And then we hear from the nurse from our doctor's office、yeah. that evening, and they told us that we needed to come all the way back downtown because there is this one specialty pharmacy, pharmacy. there where we can buy Gonol F.、Uh, right. It's not the sort of medication that here you can get at any pharmacy. pharmacy. Yeah. So we had to head all the way down there, and this was the time that I was supposed to be using to edit. That's what we wanted to do. Right. So instead, we're in the car and then waiting to get the medication. We got everything we need. Stopped at another pharmacy to get the Clomid also. Yeah. And then by the time we got back here, it was just way too late, and we had to eat. And then it put everything on hold for、yeah. the day. Yeah. And、so. we didn't really want to give you guys something that wasn't good quality.、Mm -hmm. I mean, we do. You know, I think these vlogs will be something that we look back. On for the rest of our lives, and it, we are documenting these for us and for you guys who are going through、yeah. something similar. And you know, we don't want to look back in a few years and think that we didn't do the best work that we could. So I、yeah. think that was a wise decision. That's the truth. So、yeah. thanks, guys, for taking、yeah. uh, the extra day for bearing with、yeah. us, and we hope you enjoyed it today. And、uh, we'll get this one up right away tomorrow for you, so we can get back on our schedule. Yeah. So that day that we got the gonna laugh, I started. Gonna laugh right then and there. So it was really surprising for us. Yeah, we got home and she was like, <laughs> <laughs>、um, it was really surprising because historically I started my medication on cycle day five and that was cycle day four for me. Yeah. But what happened in this month, this protocol is that it's very similar to the last medicated cycle that we did, which we did get a lot of results.、Mm -hmm. But we are doing an extra day of gonna laugh. Of 50 units of Gonalef, and we are doing 50 milligrams of Clomid for five days. We are not sure really why he's giving me this extra day of Gonalef, but I know that he saw my my blood work results and my ultrasound results, and I know that he was waiting on that to basically calculate what it is that I should be doing this this cycle. So much of this whole process, it's like guesswork. I mean, even、yeah. on, even on the doctor's part, right? They're just sort of trying to feel to their way through it, tweak, tweak little、yeah. things. And now, I guess after our last medicated cycle, well, that's our control, right? And、yeah. now he has the opportunity to adjust things、right. a little bit. And last time you were an egg machine.、So. I was, yeah. I was really, I was an egg machine. But obviously, that was also before my surgery. Right. And and obviously, it wasn't a successful cycle. It was successful in a sense of like, I ovulated a lot. Yeah. But it wasn't successful. In the sense that we did not get pregnant. One、But、of my one of my big curiosities now is what this medication is going to do to your system after after、yeah. having the pregnancy and after、yeah. you ovulated on your own、right. as well. So I don't know. It, it, in my head, it tells me that the surgery was really successful. Yeah. The repositioning of the tubes. Yeah. Um, you know, everything just sort of being flushed out,、right. opened up, mattered, and、mm -hmm. then Priscilla's body responded by itself, which I think is just a miracle. Again, it's incredible. Yeah. And yeah. then now, with the addition of these hormones, your body is just, you know, already from、Hopefully. yesterday,、yeah. you know, has been has been pumped full of hormones.、Right. What is this going to do? How many eggs? I'm excited for these ultrasounds this next week. Yeah, yeah. let's hope for twins. <laughs> Our fingers are crossed. <laughs> well, we never know, but you know, one or more. <laughs>、um, so, with that in mind, we actually have an ultrasound coming、yeah. up on Monday. It will be cycle day 11 for me. <laughs> Ideally, you know, we would be getting this ultrasound on cycle day 10, then another one on cycle day 12, and then another one how maybe on cycle day 14. 
but because cycle day 10 for me is on a Sunday we did have to kind of adapt and we're gonna go very early on Monday to get that ultrasound done and depending on the results hopefully we'll have egg growth and you know something that indicates that they are good quality eggs by their size at that point hopefully you know we will be making progress that's our hope for the cycle yeah isn't this just how infertility works too yeah. there's a whole bunch of nothing going yeah. on and then all boom, of a sudden boom 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 boom, 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 boom. It started, i mean and it yeah. started on monday for us also yeah. where all of a sudden we're like flying back downtown in a rush to get this medication oh my gosh. it's just how the process works and it's going to yeah. be a whole week of ultrasounds probably for us coming up also mm -hmm. so we're going to burn through many tanks of gas yes to get ourselves back down there but these but, are good problems yeah these very, are very good, problems. good problems yeah definitely so guys i guess this is it i mean for our for our cycle yeah this news catches right now up, yeah definitely. and we just cannot thank you guys enough for all your love and support kind words prayers and you shared your experiences with us your personal experiences and all your comments and messages made us feel so much better yeah. really really you know touched our hearts and they constantly touch our hearts because we know so many of you have gone through so much so much more difficult times and you know our hearts are with you as well and we do want you to know that we feel your love. Yeah, it puts into perspective, I think, what it is that Priscilla and I go through here. Yeah. Uh, it's it's a challenge for us down here. You know, we're a long way from home also. Right. You know, we, we don't talk about it much, but here we are down in Brazil, uh, a long way from, you know, uh, from my family, from our friends, and to have this community now, to have all of you as friends, and, you know, all of the support that you offered us, it helps us get through uh, a weekend like we just experienced. So, yeah, yeah I, I echo Priscilla's sentiments here. We can't say thank you enough for all of it. And uh, we're just so happy and excited to have you guys with us here on this journey. Yeah. Especially now that, in a sense here, we're beginning the home stretch. You know, our doctor, he left us very much with the thought that it would be one or two more rounds of timed intercourse mm -hmm. before we start IVF. Mm -hmm. So here we are, we're on it. This is yeah. either our last or second to last round of timed time intercourse. intercourse. We think, you know, you never really know for sure right. when you're doing this, but yeah. we're, we're, we're moving forward. We're, we're taking these steps with you guys and couldn't be more excited to be sharing it. Absolutely. So. I guess you guys are all caught up. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for bearing with us. Thanks thank for the you. extra day. Yes. Thanks for your patience. And thank you for watching us back to back because by the time yeah. you watch this, this is going to be Thursday and today is Wednesday as we record this. Yeah. We just uploaded a new video and we really hope that you liked both of them. We're going to come back with a brand new video on Saturday mm -hmm. and it should be a funny one. Yeah. A fun one. And yeah. then next week is just all infertility. We'll see. Yeah. We'll see where we'll it see. takes us. So thanks guys for watching this video and we hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give it a big thumbs up <laughs> and be sure to leave a lovely comment down below mm -hmm. like you always do. And if you have not already, definitely subscribe and we'll see you guys back again in our next video. Bye. Bye.